Hey my moonies, this is going to be the What's Tea Wednesday read. These reads will not normally be super long at most. I go for like eight minutes. I really don't want to make these videos every Wednesday too long because I'm going to be doing zodiac signs and just other collective general readings. So every Wednesday when I do the What's Tea to see what the tea is currently, they will not be long. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. I would love to welcome you to all our family here on this channel okay y'all i'm gonna try to be more consistent with my youtube <laughs> i'm always on tiktok which i will leave that below as well i do have a pretty decent huge platform on tiktok so go and follow me on there where i do pay readings on live as well as collective messages and zodiac reads and i also post videos on there as well i'm gonna leave my instagram below as well as my spiritual store for you guys to get candles and things of that such sage cones that you see in the background and all your spiritual needs and if you are new, welcome. 111 on the clock when I said that. So welcome in. You are meant to be here on this channel. So let's get to the tea, y'all. Because y'all know I serve the tea always. <laughs> what is the energy here? Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, I ask that you protect my energy, my space, my home as I channel these messages. What is the tea? What does the collective need to know in this time on this Wednesday? Also, you guys, check out the full moon read. I did upload that one before this one. So definitely check that out as well. Or this one's probably going to upload before that one because that one's uploading right now. Okay, it's the full moon read. All right. What is the energy here for the collective? For this what's tea? What is the tea here? What does the collective need to know in this time? What's the tea? Archangel Michael. Archangel Raphael, thank you. We have here, I'm weak, something really funny, laughing out loud, being entertained. So somebody's going to be laughing about something, whether this is you or someone else, or someone just finds something really funny, okay? What's this energy here? <laughs> Ooh, somebody could find something funny because they got receipts about something, proof, facts, truth. Okay, this could even be something that happens online or somebody tries to do something to expose someone online. Somebody, it could be that or someone just feels like they have support on their side, like evidence to, to, to blah, blah, blah. Y'all, I cannot talk all night. <laughs> somebody feels like they have evidence here to support their side. Okay, and whoever this person is, they want answers too. And they just find it funny that someone's handling something a certain way. Okay. What is the energy here? <laughs> this is crazy. This is going to be an interesting read. What is this? What's the tea? What is the, what is the tea here, Archangel Michael? What is this energy here? Yeah, bougie falling on I'm weak. Something about someone's lifestyle here. Somebody can feel like someone thinks they're too good here or, or something, a lifestyle they're living is... It's funny. They got real receipts on something here. That someone isn't who they say they are. I'm getting that as well. I'm also getting that somebody can just feel like someone is just simply bougie. Yeah. Somebody also feels like somebody is going through a glow up here. You could have told this person, go and do you. You do you. All right. You're no longer interested. You're completely over something here. You could have told somebody that, but it's like they want answers here. They want facts. They want truth. They also feel like they, they want to say what they want to say. It's something here where, where things being left unsaid, okay? And I feel like this I'm weak card is not literally somebody laughing. It's like somebody just saying I'm weak. Somebody can talk like that. They can be like, I'm weak. You get what I mean? <laughs> I don't know. Some people, Somebody can talk like that like... I'm weak. You think that was cute. You thought that was funny how you handled something. Like some some this is not somebody actually laughing, I don't feel. This is someone just like, yeah, okay. That's cute. It sounds good. How you think this gonna go? Yeah, look, savage. Like you think you savage how you handle something. But you're confident here. You're just brutally honest. 
you're not afraid or intimidated when it comes to a situation like you, you you don't care like you really don't you may not even want to hear what this person got to say look y'all's coming out <laughs> you may not want to hear what this person has to say You're just like, go for it. Whatever you want to do, however you want to handle this, whatever you think you know or whatever you think you're going to do to try to make me feel some type of way or whatever, whatever this proof is, okay? Or this is someone else and what's going on in their energy with someone else, okay? This could be someone from your past going through this with somebody else or this can be you in their situation. But whatever it is here, it's like there's evidence here to support somebody's side or on a situation, Maybe they want you to know that. Maybe they feel like you take them as a joke. Maybe they feel like you're not good enough with this. I'm, I mean, not you're not good enough, but they're not good enough for you. I'm weak with bougie here and receipts. So it could be either either or in the situation, but someone could even feel like they have something that they want to prove to you. They have truth, facts here about something. They, they want to give you answers on something. They may feel like you're too good for them or something like that as well. Yeah, I was successful, greatest of all time, talented, skilled. But somebody has a lot of feelings here. Somebody's remi reminiscing a lot about the past. They're woke up now. They're enlightened about something. They have knowledge on something. They can be getting shit done and handling something. So this is not a situation where somebody feels like you just left them where you just left them alone. Like I said, the first time around, you just left them alone. And it's like, oh, okay, that's cute. You thought it was over. And if you are dealing with somebody else, this is someone that would try to destroy that with this receipts here. Oh, well, I have proof and facts of this, this and such. Okay, if it's not that situation, then this is a situation of somebody that's leaving somebody else behind, but they may not feel like they're good enough for you. Okay. They may feel like you really don't care. You're really confident. And you have a lot of things going for yourself. You the GOAT. You know what I mean? But this person has a lot of feelings for you. They're reminiscing a lot about the past. Yes, feels. A wave of, wave of emotions. Caught up in feelings. Intense emotional reaction. This is someone that's definitely in their head. They know that they may have to come in to, with some type of proof to you. If this is someone that was with a third party... Yeah, with extra here. They were with somebody that was a drama queen. Thank you, spirit. Confirmation. They were with somebody else for some of you. And the T is, this person was a drama queen, like, doing too much. There was a lot you don't know that was going on in this situation. Like I said, something about somebody's lifestyle. Somebody trying to make it seem like they had some shit going on that really wasn't like that. I believe I said that in the beginning of this read, too. Somebody feeling as though they had, you know, they had it going on, but it really wasn't like that. The real savage, the real goat was you. Okay? So for some of y'all, it's the first situation. For others of you guys, it's the third party situation. Okay? What else? Yeah. Take good care of yourself. Works out in good shape. Body on point. Like, this person is very attracted to you. Somebody's very attracted to you. They feel like you glowed up. Yeah, you snatched. You looking good. On point. Like, this person, like I said, they feel like they may not even be good enough for you. Like, if this is someone you haven't dealt with in a, in a while from your past and they went to a third party, it's like you've changed. I'm hearing over the years. Yeah, slay. Succeed in something. Accomplish a goal. Very impressive. Like, you may even be a business owner for some of you. Or just be have a serious career where you make good money. Like, everything about you is attractive. And this person may want to leave somebody alone, a, a third party here. Leaving and not caring. I'm done with you. Get out of my face. Yeah. And they can have a group of friends involved in this. There could be a, a sister, a brother, or just an inner circle of friends involved in this situation. But this person's like, I need to tell my truth. Look, I got receipts. I need to tell my truth. Keep it 100 Tell me the truth. Be completely honest. Don't hold back. And this person's like, I'm not. Like when you go into court and they tell you to put your hand up, tell the truth and nothing but the truth. Yeah. This person's dodging someone, avoiding someone because the person that they want is you. 
before anyone else. Look, and that is the tea. Spilling the tea, yes. Okay? They want to tell you something here. All right? Somebody wants to tell you something. Okay, you guys? But that is what I have for you guys for this What's the Tea Wednesday. I am, this, this is going to be fun doing these every Wednesday. <laughs> but I love you guys. Hit the like, subscribe, check out the um, description box, follow my other platforms, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, Moonies.